at the end of this training video you will learn what is asme what is history of asme different codes in asme bpvc and their field of application introduction to asme section 9 and its importance and what are the requirement to qualify as quality welds let's start with the history ASME stands for American Society of Mechanical Engineers. It was founded in New York in 1880 in response to numerous steam boiler pressure vessel failures. First performance test code of steam boilers trail was conducted conducted in 1884. First revision of an ASME standard was made in 1900. ASME produces approximately 600 codes and standards covering many technical areas. ASME was founded by Mr. Henry, Mr. Alexander. and mr john adson sweet the table here shows the timeline of asme as we can see here the topic of our today discussion about asme section 9 it was first introduced in 1941 the table here list the asme codes we can see here on our left hand side the asme code and on right hand side the applications and here section 9 is for welding and bridging ASME section 9 is a qualification standard for welding bridging and fusing procedures welders brazier and welding and bridging and fusing operators let's try to understand the structure of ASME section 9 it is divided into four part the first one is qg the second part is qw the third part is qf and the last one is qb where QG stand for general requirement in QB the requirement for welder and welding W welding procedure specified QF for plastic fusing and QB is for bridging requirements so let's know what is the purpose of ASME section 9 The main purpose of ASME section 9 is to qualify quality welds. A quality weld is weld where a qualified welder using a qualified weld procedure with an appropriate environment results in a good weld. So how we can produce a quality welds? Let's understand the main requirements. for a quality weld the first requirement is to have a qualified welding procedure specification or wps the second requirement we need a welder to perform the welding and here welder we mean a qualified welder the third requirement is we need a 
code which has all the guidelines to qualify WPAS and welder. So here we need ASME section 9. The fourth requirement for any fabrication we need a construction code or which has the requirement for the design, acceptance and testing. And not to forget we need a welding inspector to perform all these tasks. You can watch our video about welding inspection, what are different types, it's available on our YouTube channel. So next why we need ASME section 9? Why it's section 9? being asked to qualify welders and procedures. As we know, it is referenced by the primary codes such as ASME section 1 and ASME section 8. Also many times it has been asked by the clients to meet its the requirement of ASME section 9. Hope you have liked our video. Please stay connected with us for upcoming ASME section 9 series next video on general requirements. As we are going to cover all section 9 in different parts. So please don't forget to subscribe our channel to stay updated. Thank you very much.